Hello YouTube, this is Mr. Zegan. I'm back with One Punch Man. Chapter 155 came out probably 12 hours, not even 12 hours ago, maybe like 6 hours ago, 6 to 8 hours ago. I wanted to record some of the new FNAF game, um, so I recorded at least 3 parts. You guys will get probably at least 1 part tonight, uh, today, maybe 2. If you don't get 2 today, you'll get 2 tomorrow, but... Um, yeah, so One Punch Man came out. This one is called Results. Otherwise, I'm putting this up. Just, this is for a note for me. Oh. Okay. It's just because I have to try to get some sleep here soon. I also want to get this done today, Sunday, because I'm getting a tooth pulled Monday. Um, afternoon, getting a wisdom tooth pulled. So, not fun, but that's what's happening. Um, just for a heads up, so if you don't get a lot of videos on Monday, that's why I'm gonna try to record everything that I need to go up Monday, uh, Sunday night. I'm hoping that way at least. Oh. Also, sorry if my voice is a little. I'm like congested, and that is just. Ugh. One Punch Man, Chapter 155 Results. Fist in. Fist in wills. Half yet to cross for now. We have a picture of. It, this has to be Saitama's. Fist and then the other has to be Garu. So last we left off Saitama and then popped out of the portal. So now it's this. It's we're over Saitama and Flash Fash and the alien. We're all on the ground. That 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 is Mr. Saitama A king yelling to him. What happened here? Did we just warp? What about old guy Blast? Was well, everyone defeated? And it's Slash Fast looking over and we seeing uh, Ian, um, Atomic Samurai, Zombie Man, Pure Pure Prisoner, Child Emperor, all lying on the ground. Hmm. Flash Fast notices it, but also Saitama. It's just Garo, the hero hunter. Uh, just standing out in front of him. A monster. A hero. <laughs> so Goro is mostly in his sense right now. Looking at Saitama and Flash Flash. Saitama is now running at Garu. Nope, past Garu. Oh, he spotted Genos. Because Genos is really badly damaged. Missing hair. Torn apart. You got wrecked again, huh, Genos? Are you okay? M Master. Is that the guy who wrecked you? No. The enemy cadre I was struggling with. King with King took care of him with his ultimate move. King's ultimate move. I can only think of the damn infinite combo from that game. But it's strange. I can feel the same ultra high energy of King's ultimate move coming from that monster. It could be a malfunction. Saitama was looking back. What happened to me? Not to mention this body. I don't even remember resurfacing from the underground. I lost con consciousness underground, buried in the rubble then. I was dreaming about the past. So Bang kind of brought the past back into him. I can perceive the hesitation in your fists. First train your heart, then follow the voice of your heart. Oh, flashbacks, flashy flash, 
goes to kick uh, Goro, and Goro dodges. Whoa! Which makes sense. Flash Black Sword got pulled apart many, many chapters ago. He dodged? You! You are S Class Rank 13 Flashy Flash. You're a hero. Yet you sucker kicked me like that? Are you the only survivor of the Monster Association? You really made a massive mess of things out here. Are you the Monster King boss? Monster King? Uh, I guess there was someone like that, huh? You better remember this well. My name is Guru. I'm. I'm the one who's gonna rise to disaster level god and straighten this world out. Guru? The human monster? Hero hunter? Just so you know, I've got nothing to do with the Monster Association. They can't fit me into that pathetic little box, you know. Just as I thought. Allow me to pass through for a moment. What the fuck? So you have Platinum Sperm. Has already sped past both of them. Hitting Flashy Flash multiple times. And Garo multiple times when he passes by. Oh, I'm I'm having very... I can't breathe out of my nose. It's mostly mouth breathing. Ugh. I, I like breathing out my nose only. Usually. Yeah, so the, he got they both got attacked multiple times. We see that again in panels here. You have m monster eyes that much, but still do not have the courage to choose the side of the monsters. How disappointment. Disappointing. BM Garu. We should have disposed of you from the very start. Huh, there. Was well, one more left then. Thanks for coming out and saving me the trouble of searching for you. I'll take you both on at once. You shall fall to the S-Class here of Flashy Flashes. Superior technique. Techniques. I'll take on anyone who wants a fight. Absolute evil is unbiased, you know. Heroes, monsters, I will slay every last one of yem. One of... Yem? Yem? Them? And rise up to become the ultimate symbol of fear, disaster level god. And we just have Goro in his, the like the black suit of it's like um a uh, shell, armor shell. More like, and it's him just cracking his knuckles. I just cracked one. I can't crack the other ones because I think I did it during one of my earlier videos. Come get some. So you have Platinum Sperm charging about, you have Flashy Flash charging about, and Guru, the hero hunter, all charging into bar battle. Flashy Flash and Atomic um, sorry, Atomic Sperm, Platinum Sperm, both collide, they're blocking each other's attacks. And from above, here comes Guru, the hero hunter. They both just realize... He stomps down and it sends a tidal wave of just debris from the impact outwards. You see Flash Flash and Platinum Sperm backed up before Garo landed. What the fuck? Then from all the debris it just seems like there's rocks in the sky. And we all just see lines. I'm guessing this is them attacking each other or jumping off the rocks at really fast speeds and just attacking us. We can't see anything other than points uh, to rocks and debris them jumping off of and just intersections where there's just bright white um, flash in each of the areas or I don't even know how to describe this. Oh, back over King. Mr. Saitama! King! I knew you, you'd you do it for us, Mr. Saitama. Do what? 
Hey, Woods. Good thing you didn't get hurt. I... I believe in you. I knew you showed up. I was so scared, though. And I forgot to mention, uh, King slid down the hill and has both arms on uh, Saitama's shoulders and, like, bowing his head down. I was so scared, though. I did everything I could as a stone. Ah, ahem. It's funny I wouldn't be able to show you the fruits of my labor, but I am sure, sure am glad you made it in time, Mrs. Saitama. Yeah. What do you mean, as a stone? Ugh, my kidney stones, you know. Mr. Genos risked his life to save Miss Ta Tasumaki. It was v truly admirable. So that's why. You really hung in there, Genos. Nice fight. Genos's eyes... Like... He's very surprised to hear this. And then we have a panel of Jonas looking over and it's King and Saitama lifting Tasumaki off the ground to check on her. Master. We're back over Jonas. Master. When the time came for me to self-destruct, I was no longer able to do it. Can you truly say I've become stronger? I don't really get it. But you didn't blow up, right? Satama is pointing it on his core. What the fuck? We got a color page. We got a like, big spread. That means this part here got stronger too, doesn't it? In the background, we see those lines that we were seeing before. Of them jumping off rocks and stuff. And they're all colored either red, yellow, or blue. And there's intersections that make green and other things. It's like a starry background. It's really cool. Jonas is very surprised by what Saitama just said. Master, it's all thanks to you and Dr. Cusino. I didn't do anything. That day, there was... There were confirm confirmations of a geometr geometric structure of light covering the skies over Z City. This this was reported by all parties to be another supernatural phenom uh, phenomenon attributed to Tasumaki and the other espers. And it's two people in the helicopter watching. And then we're back over to... I can't think of his name. He's the um, he's the one that fought Saitama in the martial arts tournament in the final round. It's him in the bed still healing with his sister. And then we're seeing two people from the Hero Association watching the battlefield. However, little did anyone but the people on site know that these were the trails of a battle between three superhuman beings. So yeah, I was correct. Every clash is one of these white dots or these white flashes or red, whatever color it would be. But the there's these clusters that just looks like flashes and the other ones are just lines. The flashes are where they're intersecting. We're flashy flash and platinum sperm and uh, Guru. We see two. We see flashy flash and platinum sperm colliding for one, and then we're seeing one about to happen of uh, flashy flash colliding with Guru, the hero hunter, and then in the background, it platinum sperm and the hero hunter. And then one just of Hero Hunter in the back. Like, it's all happening within seconds. Next panel is just Goro and Flash Flash coming in to attack each other. 
And it looks like Goro actually was able to get an attack off on Flashy Flash. And then, out of nowhere, Platinum Storm grabs Flashy Flash around the neck with his tentacle, with his head, head tentacle, whatever you want to call it, the antennae, and wrapped it around, is wrapping it around Flashy Flash's necks. Stopping Flashy Flash, and now he's just pumbling Flashy Flash, just pointing all his moves into the back of Flashy Flash. You see, next battle, Flashy Flash is just spinning up blood. Gah! Oh, Flashy Flash is actually pull, pulling out a move. Wind Blade Kick! Platinum Firm gets away in time. Doesn't do anything. Heh. <laughs> Go! Flash is weakened due to losing his main weapon. The smart play here could be to concentrate our attacks together and finish him off. Then move on to our one-on-one -on -one battle. Don't you think? And then Garu thinks to himself and then says, I see ganging up on him. I see ganging up on him then. And says, got it. And he's going for a punch. I'm hoping he punches Platinum Sperm. He does. He punches Platinum Sperm just in the face. And you can see the punch actually making contact and actually imprinting on it into Platinum's face. Because Platinum is open at this point. And spin up blood. Gah! How dare you! <laughs> like I'd ever take... Or... Take or... Take orders from you. You half-monster! I feel it. I'm getting close to perfection for perfecting my own technique his own martial artist not water stream rock smashing fists not whirling iron cutting fists not exploding heart release fists not tiger fang true fists not purgatory abyss fists not lake breaking ice river fists not fool's path mountain range fists not ultimate fists of the Yaka Yata Gash Gashu Not Pressure Point Killer Fist Not Poisonous Ogre Fist Not Lone Fist of pr Prosperity Though Battle I've absorbed all of these but my own technique Since it's connected to disaster level god I'll name it Monster Clam the God Fist we just see a foreshadow of, just see a sh um, color, not color, a shadow version of Garu, and we can see his arms, but he has the two arms, but with him moving so quickly, he has multiple at this point. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It looks like at least eleven arms. Maybe more, but there's 11 right now we can count. No way. And now, different name. Monster. Monster Calamity God Slayer Fist. <coughs> I'm sorry. And he's throwing all his punches he has into Garu. And Garu gets sent... Not Garu, sorry. Garu is sending all these punches into Platinum Sperm. You can see Platinum Sperm body is getting thrown back. And we see Flash Vash dodging backwards from this. It does seem like he probably got an attack or two on him. But his... Garu's quick... Just his... Punches are so fast, it looks like he has he's attacking with 11 fists. Come on, come on, no. Gatling gun. 
Oh. Oh. Sorry, I'm. Oh, fuck. And then next page is just Garu. Him falling in the air, but you can see Flashy Flash and Platinum Storm just falling to the ground behind him in order to dominate this world as the absolute evil and beat down humanity into an abyss of despair. Something as unreliable as God shall be crushed by my hand as well. Oh no, I'm hoping, hoping he fights Saitama. I'm guessing him mentioning God uh, will mean something here because at the next panel is he just you can see a star glowing at the bottom of the pit where uh, Flashy Flash and them got teleported from. Also, uh, when this was also being said, you can see the moon in the background with the the crater that looks like an eye staring in, staring down on this plane of existence. Okay, so what what we're seeing down in the twinkling uh, um, twinkling light is actually the lava pit down where Guru, uh, the Monster King, got defeated, and we're just seeing a pit of ooze. I'm guessing maybe living membrane because you can see actually veins in this, like white ooze all over the cave. And then back, we're seeing back up to the surface with the light show, as they would call it. And the moon looking down on it. And we see... So, if you guys don't know what this is, and you're reading this... They redid a bunch of chapters of One Punch Man. And this is one of the changes they did. Where Orochi found, found out... He thought he needed to sacrifice someone at this altar... To be able to uh, uh, become this godlike creature. But it's actually saying that Orochi had to be sacrificed for this godlike creature to be summoned. So Orochi in his dying breaths from Saitama's fighting him. Crawls up on this altar and dies and we can... The next couple panels is just shaking. So what we're seeing now is a close-up of the painting. And then something just forming. We can see the shadow of like a centipede monster forming. And now we're out by the ocean. We can see a bunch of water flowing down. So whatever's happening, I don't know if... This is water coming from a source up on the battlefield or what? That might be evil natural water. That might be evil natural water draining into the ocean. That we're seeing right now. And then we're seeing a super nuclear aircraft carrier. Gats okay. Gats okay. What is that light? It's a captain. Captain, there's a massive object surfacing on the starboard side. Type unknown cannot evade. All hands to bridge. We can see down, we can see the ship and then down below it is just an energy source. That is just a, like a condensed energy source and then a shield and you can see the wavering of the shield or whatever this entity is down in the water on this this oh this radar is awesome brace for impact holy shit and all we see next fucking pa fucking great page is the whole airship carrier tilting to its side it's about to be flipped over when two giant massive eyeballs come out of the water. That's either evil natural water consuming even more water. Or 
that's a beast entirely to itself. And that's the end of the chapter. Oh, no. I want more. I want more. Let me, let me make real quick sure that that was that absolute exit. The last page. I say I want more, but I don't know how much I could actually read more of that before it would actually start hurting my voice more. Yeah, so that was the last page. Apparently there is a bonus like side story within the volume which maybe I'll cover. It's not much. It's Yeah, <sighs> uh, maybe. Maybe later on because volume 24 came out chapter 118. Uh, maybe we'll cover that sometime else. Otherwise, that's the end of the chapter. God damn. Um, 27 minutes. That's not bad. I'm going to have to go take... Oh, God. Uh, I'm going to have to go take medicine uh, because my throat is killing me. And my, I'm all congested and I really want to try get stuff rendered and get... I'm hoping to get this scheduled sometime It'll come out Sunday night, so I'm sorry, but maybe Sunday afternoon. It depends on how I get stuff rendered and how quickly I can get it up. Uh, otherwise, that was chapter 155 results. I'm giving this a 9 out of 10 because I don't know if that's evil natural water or if that's the monster that's supposed to be the god or whatever. There's so much the re if you haven't read any of the revised chapters I recommend going and reading them because it shows off these changes that they just showed off it they even if it's a few pages or a whole chapter but they do put these changes in that still connect back to chapters that they have uh, written pretty well to uh, connect right back through My guess is since the earthquake is happening, the whole area is rising up from down below. And that's all evil natural water that's flowing into the ocean. And that's what we're seeing come up. That would be my guess. I think this might be called, my guess it's... My guess is it's evil natural water or something along the lines of that. Um, because I that's the only thing I could think of. Otherwise, we might have even bigger fault on our plan. Platinum platinum sperm is being taken out by Garo. And if he gets taken out that way, I want to see Taitama fight Garo and just show him how out of league Garo thinks he's on a whole nother league, but... Also, if Garo takes him out, it can be one hell of a thing. Otherwise, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like the video, like, give, it, uh, give it a like. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, I recommend subscribing to the channel. Keep up with all content. 
Otherwise, it's been Miss Goods again. Signing off. Have a good morning. Have a good afternoon. Have a good night. Wherever you are, just have a good day. Hopefully, I'll see you guys next video. Also, real quick, um, I feel like a video of like, but yeah. Uh, also, when we hit 2,500 subscribers, we'll be doing two $25 gift card giveaways. Uh, both at the same time. So, no matter how many people enter, you have to be subscribed um, to be entered. Um, no matter how many people enter this competition, when uh, the giveaway, when we do hit it, we will give out two. So, it will be a video when we get even closer, but... Uh, that was 155, and I'm hoping that's Evil Natural Water, because I don't even know what you do now, because Evil Natural Water is the ocean. I don't know who defeats the ocean. Do we send Torg in from Borderlands, and he blows up the ocean? I don't know how they do deal with this. I have no clue. Otherwise, really... Hope you guys do have a good day and hopefully I do see you guys next video. Peace.